Hello. Today we're going to talk about how to create data shortcuts inside of our Civil 3D drawings. Right here I have a drawing which I used from a previous tutorial on how to create surfaces. Inside of this drawing we can see in our Prospector tab that there is already a surface called EG in this drawing. However, <clears throat> I'm going to create a second file that I want to use to do some more um, some more things on my drawing, such as, let's say, create a grading plan for later. In this drawing, I'm going to change the map coordinate system so that it matches with my previous coordinate. And now this drawing is ready to have other data referenced inside of it. However, if we simply do an XREF to bring this drawing the previous drawing inside of it. I'm just going to type in xref, find that drawing base file. The problem is, is that this comes in with zero intelligence on it. All that it will bring in are my lines. And let's zoom to that. <clears throat> so if I hold my mouse over it, all I see is that it's an external reference. However, I do not see any surface inside of this drawing. Therefore, what we're going to have to do is use another tool called Data Shortcuts. The way that we do this is through around four steps. The first step is we go to our Manage tab, and then we go over to Set Working Folder. I'm going to set it to this Capstone folder. The next thing I'll do is I'll click Create New Shortcuts folder. I'm going to name it um, Data Shortcuts. Can't spell today. Capstone. I'm going to hit Enter, leave everything else default. The third thing I'm going to do is set Shortcuts folder to that location, Data Shortcuts Capstone. Finally, what I'm going to do is look down here, and I can see that in my prospector that this data shortcut is referencing to that same location that I just set. Now I can use this button, Create Data Shortcuts, and it's going to tell me I need to associate it to the current drawing, which is not difficult. I right-click on this data shortcut, click Associate Project to Current Drawing, that is the correct working folder, the correct project I want. <clears throat> and now I click Create Data Shortcuts. I'm going to select that surface and hit OK. And now I look down here and I can see that surface is now inside of my Data Shortcuts drop down. So I'm going to go and navigate to my second drawing, this grading, and I'll go over to the prospector, go to Surfaces, and I can see that that surface is in here as well. I'll right click on it, click Create Reference, and it's going to ask me some drop down information. I'm going to hit OK on that. And now I have just brought in the surface into this drawing, and we can tell that because of this little arrow right here next to the name. This is how we know which drawing the surface lives in. When we select the surface right over here, it shows us what is the source file name. This way we can always identify where that file is coming from. Thank you for watching.